Hi guys, he's Peter. Welcome to test number four. You know that I'm running with my flow app the test of any number sequence which you share with me as I ask you in the email. And this time I receive 2000 numbers from David. So here is the file and I will give it a try. So I'm op I opening the first instance of flow app and I'm using money management scheme or mode number two. You can see that I'm actually playing with variance from average three and two levels, each level eight spins. And as I already gave it a try and I saw the results, so this test will be in slight minus. And then I want to show you what you might do if you see such a result. So it seems in a, let's say the trend and robustness is still very good because there is not a huge drawdown and but your bankroll is simply after 2000 spin in a minus. So you are lo looking for some setup and money management idea how you might improve it. And this I'm going to show you because I'm going to change only two things to see much much better result out of these 2000 numbers from David. So I'm going to show you what you can achieve if you think and test precisely and it's not about overfitting so I'm always saying please be careful and avoid the overfitting your equity curve. So if you would have a, for example, 2000 numbers and you would be constantly trying to change like spins eight, nine, 10, and waiting when, when the result is more positive, more positive, then you are overfitting the curve. So you are actually not having a robust system, but you are just fine tuning your settings for certain already given number sequence. So be aware of that. Therefore, I'm asking from you to send me any number sequence from your any favorite online casino, then I can test the robustness of the app. And this is the key for me, right? So time to time, if you have a bankroll doing a test in minus, it's all fine. It's normal. And you can a little bit change the settings, but then do not test always the same sequence, right? Better is to press the button RNG and generate completely new original absolutely not repeating number sequence and then you can see whether your new settings is really something like what works or not so now you can see then our drawdown was something like 200 in 2000 spins and our bankroll is minus and i want to show you that i change just two things and let's use the mode 4 but if you check that the mode 4 is using the same eight spins per level, two levels, that's the same. Same progression aggressiveness, base bet. And what is different is variance from average is four and only one cycle, comparing to three and two cycles. Search and spins 20, ratio one and two the same. And what I'm going to change here is overstep. And I will let it run. And I hope then, <laughs> based on my previous tests and check then the bankroll size will be much different. So therefore I'm gonna show you then from these let's see results I can say then the flow app provides extremely very nice robustness because okay one test was in a minus one hundred which is nothing it's just a small minus if you compare two thousand spins and on the other side then if you just change a little bit your money management and one condition like overstep and you will see what kind of different results much more positive results you can get out of it so and overstep is actually i remember then last time i explained to you then it's connected to search in spins in fact it's connected to fixed constant value which is 36 spins and it's part of the condition and just to explain it to you in more in detail so i uh, using several conditions like for example ratio one and two it has to be equal or higher in the last 
2 times 20 spins to fulfill these two conditions. On top I'm also combining overstep condition. So I'm looking for any fixed pattern and we know I'm using 10 fixed patterns. I'm looking for any fixed pattern having number of hits exactly equal 5 if my overstep is 5 in last 36 spins. If this is true, this condition is fulfilled and then I'm checking other con conditions like ratio 1 and 2. All of them they have to be fulfilled and maybe one or two more conditions, not so important. And if yes, then I'm going through for the selection of the fixed pattern which to bet on. So yes, it, it's a bit complex. On the other hand, it's not a super complicated and you can actually influence that. You can play with that overstep and ratios in your own app or algorithm and see the results. So now we receive the, the completely different bankroll I would say. So when you can see then I use the same 2000 number sequence. First setup was just a first try with slightly different money management and overstep one. I just changed the money management with variance per average and overstep and the difference is huge. You can see then we had mostly zero drawdown which is absolutely unbelievable, very great result and the bankroll is also pretty nice one. If you double click on session base bet you see that the maximum base bet was 3.2 which is all fine, here it was 3.3, right? So you can see then we receive with a slight change of money management and overstep like a parameter for flow app really different results and significantly different results so i would say this is also a very nice test from david thank you very much for this number of sequence and i really like very much this let's say result i was also a bit testing with overstep six or even seven and i always receive a positive result so five was the most profiting one the others also ended up with something like around three or four hundred in plus. Thank you very much for watching this number four episode testing your your own number sequences from any online roulette. And of course you can send me new number sequences and I'll be happy to test it and see how the robustness goes with the flow app. So far it looks pretty good. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye-bye.